this video I'm going to show you how to fit the XT Plus to your pole. Now, firstly you have to watch the video called Preparing Your Pole for Internal Tubing. And in that video we showed you how to run the tube internal and cut it with a double barb joiner fitted. So now what I can do in fitting the XT Plus, I can just feed that tube into the XT Plus and then put the XT Plus up and you'll hear it hit a certain mark. That's the maximum overlap and the proper overlap. Then we can lock the clamp down so there's no movement. And you'll see that we've got the clamp in alignment with the other clamps. And what that ensures is that the tube will be coming out the bottom of the XT Plus and that's what we need. Now that we've got the XT Plus and we've got the tube coming out of the bottom, we can now grab an XT section and feed the XT section onto the XT Plus, yeah, and close that clamp there. So now you can see, I've kept the, the mini small, but now we've got our tube coming out externally. Then the last step is connecting our water-fed tube to the internal tubing for the pole, and now if we need to push the Mini up, and I haven't extended it, that's another video, is using the Mini and the XT. But now you can see that as I push that pole up, I've got the tube internal for the whole length of the Mini, or the Pro. And it's just coming up before we go to the extension sections, and then we can extend the XT section without any conflict with the internal tubing. And that means you can have the XT on and more importantly, at any time, you can pull the XT off. So that's the key in how you fit the XT Plus to be used between the Mini or the Pro and the XT. Okay?